Hello guys and welcome to another video. So today I'm going to show you how to make these two different Harry Potter back to school DIYs, a wand, pencil, and a Harry Potter quote notebook. So continue watching to see how to make them. For the notebook you will need a composition notebook, a Harry Potter quote, which I use the I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. I made that using PicMonkey but you can use whatever editor you want to. You'll need a paper bag. First take the paper bag and place the notebook on top. Now you want to make sure the notebook is center and then mark off where the notebook is located on the bag. Now this part that you're marking off is the inside of where you're going to be folding over onto the notebook so make sure you like the other side better and then cut it out. Once you're done, I did accidentally cut one part so I had to tape it but you won't see that because it's inside. Take the notebook and place it back down and start folding over the edges and you can use tape or glue or whatever you have on you to secure it down onto the notebook. Now you also might need to cut slits into it to make sure it fits nicely onto the notebook and keep on doing that until you're done. I stapled mine and didn't glue or tape mine. Then you just want to take the paper bag and cut it out. Um, to align with the notebook because I didn't have it all the way even but if yours is even then you don't need to worry about that and then cut out the quote and glue that onto the notebook you're going to wait until that dries and then you are completely done with your notebook now I used some glaze to glue on or place on the um, quote but you can use glue whatever you have on you to make sure it sticks on you could even use double sided tape but I thought that the glaze um, glaze and glue are more preferable and would stay better and that's what it looks like you can put your subject onto the side of the book next let's go to the wand pencil so you'll need a colored pencil hot glue gun paint palette and whatever colors you want to paint your um, wand start hot gluing a design First you want to do the handle to the top of the colored pencil or you can use a pencil or a pen whatever you have on you and then you can add like different vines or designs onto it until you're happy with the shape of it. Now you want to make sure the hot glue dries before you touch it or you will burn yourself so if you need a parent to help you then please do that. So I added a little drip effect on the top and then I um did little vine effect onto the sides then I painted it with I used a light brown and then once I did a co coat on that I added the dark brown and then afterwards I did a dry brush effect onto it with the green but you do whatever you want to and using whatever paints you have I did water down the paint to make sure it would be a nice even thin coat for each one that I painted on so it looked nice in the end I did tape off the um, tip of it at first but then the tape fell off and I realized that I could just sharpen it and then it would be fine so you can go ahead and do that until you are happy with your result you can glaze it if you want to but I thought there was no need and I wanted it to look more like wood so that's it I hope you guys enjoyed watching like comment subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!